Almighty God, we thank you for calling your daughter Kathleen to gather your people once more on this day as we celebrate the fifth anniversary of our concert dedicated to your hope, peace, love, and joy in the world. Send your Holy Spirit to guide and bless us as we continue to spread the light of your love. This we ask through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, the Savior and Redeemer you have sent to guide us. Amen. Please be seated. Good evening, everyone. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you to our beloved St. John's Cathedral and to our fifth annual Advent Christmas concert. For the past two years, due to the COVID-19 pandemic, the concert was held virtually. We must thank our Heavenly Father for this wonderful day he has given us to be here today face to face, glorifying, worshiping, and praising him through songs, music, and dance. Visitors, invited guests, and members of St. John's Cathedral Congregation, I invite you to enjoy these musical arrangements and perform and performance for we have prepared a special night for you today. We have prepared a concert of joy, of peace, of hope, and of love. At this time, I kindly ask that you do not record our live stream as we will be doing a special performance recording and it will be aired at a date to be announced. Thank you. We light the candle for joy. The joy of the Lord is your strength, Nehemiah 8 to 10. Up for joy, it will not disappoint. If you do, it will be a triumphant point. For joy always brings a sense of relief as you give to Jesus the cause of your grief. For happiness is a choice. Each day you can make and rejoice in the Lord will cause a smile to break. Choose joy. You'll be happier if you do. Then just watch what Jesus is willing to do. Rejoice in the Lord always, and again I say rejoice.
sorrows tonight. Yeah, I'm trading my sorrows and I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. Oh, I'm trading my sickness and I'm trading my pain. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. Won't you help me sing? Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. You're sounding good. Let's sing it again. I'm trading, I'm trading my sorrows. I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. Oh, I'm trading my sickness and I'm trading my pain. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. We say yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. I'm pressed but not crushed, persecuted, not abandoned. Struck down but not destroyed. I am blessed beyond the curse, for his promise will endure. That his joy is going to be my strength. Though sorrow may last for the night, his joy comes in the morning. I'm trading my sorrow, and I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. joy of the Lord. Won't you help me say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. 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 Say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord, amen.
sounding good tonight. Help me sing again. Yes, Lord. Amen. 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 Say yes, Lord. Amen. One more time. Yes, Lord. Amen. John chapter 14, verse 27. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid. Peace, some definitions, an absence of war, a quiet or calm, calm state of mind agreement or harmony among people. Prayer. Lord, make me an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is error, truth. Where there is doubt, faith. Where there is despair, hope. Where there is darkness, light. And where there is sadness, joy. O oh, divine master, Grant that I may not so much seek to be consoled as to console, to be understood as to understand, to be loved as to love, for it is in giving that we receive. It is in pardoning that we are pardoned. Singing glory, glory. 
voice speaks for the voiceless. Hope for the hopeless. Emmanuel. One love brings us together now and forever. Emmanuel. We're singing.
light the candle for love. And now, these three remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. 1 Corinthians 13 to 13. Love always conquers whatever this word brings. For love is God eternal, and his love can renew what is cold and lifeless. For love can bring new meaning and give it back new life. Don't give up on love when it seems that all is lost, for there is always hope if we are prepared to pay the cost. For love is always worth it, no matter how much the price, for love will be much stronger when we trust in Jesus Christ. So let God have full reign. Let him live within your heart. Then you will know true love. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. John 3.16 Jesus come today for a poor, poor man like me. Salvation come my way, my soul set free. Jesus come for all and we must hear his call. Open up your heart today and let it be.
save our sons and daughters. Did you know that your baby boy has come to make you new? This child that you deliver will soon deliver you. Mary, did you know that your baby Inside to a blind man, Mary, did you know that your baby boy will calm the storm with his hand? Did you know that your baby boy has walked where angels trod when you kissed your little baby? You kissed the face.
for hope. Hope is not wishful thinking or finger crossing. It is a confident expectation of good things to come. This hope we have is an anchor for the soul, both sure and steadfast. And our hope will not disappoint, for the Lord takes pleasure in those who hope in him. When I came into this room, my heart was heavy. I struggled just to make it through the day. Suddenly I felt a holy presence. And the pain inside began to slip away. And right away I knew that something happened. Reflected with expressions on each face. Suddenly I felt a holy presence. And I knew that this must be a holy place. Yeah, there is healing in this house. Healing in this house. Manifest that peace to come. And trouble hearts to healing come. There is healing in this house restoration in this place there is mercy mercy and there is grace bring your burdens one by one and leave them here where they belong there is healing in this house there is healing in this house Healing in this house, manifest that peace to come, and trouble hearts to healing come. There is healing in this house, restoration in this place. There is mercy, mercy, and there is grace. Bring your burdens one by one and leave them here where they belong. There is healing in this house, healing for your soul. There is healing for your mind. If you're heavy laden, there is peace for troubled time. There is healing for your soul, healing for your mind. If you're heavy laden, there is peace for troubled time. There is healing in this house, restoration in this place. There is mercy, mercy, and there is grace. Bring your burdens one by one and leave them here where they belong. There is healing in this house. There is healing in this House. Love incarnate, love divine, star and angels gave the sun. Bow to babe on bended knee, the savior of humanity. Unto us a child is born, he shall reign forevermore. No way, no way. Come 
and see what God has done. Noel, Noel, the story of amazing love, the light of the world given for us. Son of God and Son of Man, there before the world began, born to suffer, born to save, born to raise us from the
thank you to all the persons who helped to make this concert a reality. But first, I'd just like to welcome all of you to the cathedral adjoining Islam in saying, welcome, welcome. The list of persons is extremely long as the, as the program shows, but we will start with some special persons to say thanks. The Advent to Christmas concert started five years ago, and there are five special set of musicians who have been with us throughout the five years. And we would like to honor those musicians at this time. Uh, Father Taylor, would you come forward, please? We have a short presentation to those who have stuck with us over the five years. The first we want to mention is Nazarene Praise Team. Don't come yet. The Nazarene Praise Team, you might think, are a group of people who worship at the Nazarene Church, but not necessarily so. They are teachers at the Nazarene High School. And an incredible group of teachers, I want to say. Also, they practice during their spare time right in the staff room. And year after year, they have come back and give us natural harmonies for the songs they sing. And so we wanted to honor them. This year, they have new leadership, but I'm going to call on Ms. Alta Garbutt, who has interacted with me for the past four years. Ms. Garbutt, would you come, please? I just wanted to read, it says, this certificate of appreciation for five years of outstanding performance at its annual Advent to Christmas concert is presented to the Nazarene Praise Team. Congratulations. And next on the list is Mr. Mark Phillips. And Mr. Mark is no stranger to the world of music, so he needs no introduction. Mark, thank you for being here all these years. And of course, there's steel band Mike. Mike Usher, would you come forward, please? You're welcome. And then we would like to ask the manager of Belize Choral Society, Mr. Clement Wade, to come. All through the pandemic, they had to reduce the choir, but they came out just the same. And last year, Mr. Wade took it upon himself to make sure the choir had representation and sang in a quartet. So thank you, Mr. Wade. And this year's concert has been named What a Glory, the song that we just heard Belize Choral Society sing. And Sir Colville Young once told me that of all the Christmas songs he has written, that is his favorite song. So we thought we would name the, the concert after him, in his honor, after that song, because he has stuck with us for five years. And it's incredible because Sir Colville doesn't miss a note. And I'll, I'll give your age away because everybody knows Sir Colville. Sir Colville made 90, and he just played that piano and didn't miss a note. And an insider told me he started taking lessons at age four. So that's 86 years of correct notes. <laughs> Sir Colville, it has been an honor and a pleasure have you serve us through your music and
first we begin with our sponsors, we want to say thank you for your generous support, which has contributed to the realization of this evening's program. And if you're in house, I'd like to call the names of the sponsors and you can take, you can stand and be acknowledged. First on the list is Atlantic Insurance Company. There's Diversified Life Solutions. I think represented here by the one and only Mr. Harry P. Mr. Harry P, please stand up. Thank you. <laughs> and we have James Brodies and Company. Late contribution, so the name doesn't appear, but it. And there is uh, Print Belize, who generously did the programs for us. Priority security with Mr. and Mrs. Ellsworth Goff. Please stand and be acknowledged. Thank you. Thank you. And Young's Engineering Consultancy. Protel BPO and Simon Cohen. Those are our corporate sponsors. And now the individual sponsors, Mr. Steve Duncan, His Excellency Lin Young, Mr. Rodwell Williams, Mrs. Melba Jean Stain, Mrs. Claudette Moody, Mrs. Marina Stain. And now our very own congregation members who have put in their part. Mrs. Elsie Hingston, Mr. Anthony Sankey, you can stand and be acknowledged. Mm -hmm. Colville Young Jr., Joy Ross and family, Imogene Kerr, Paul and Dorothy Garcia, Lorraine Woods, Michael and Lilith Soberanis, McKinley and Sherry King, Penny Casasola, Noella Wattler, Kenrick and Marlene Leslie, Glenda Fuller, Wilbert Zelaya, and Kathleen Jex. Thank you all for your generosity. And now to our performers. Of course, the show wouldn't exist if we didn't have musicians. We would like to thank all our choirs and their directors for their hard work and dedication. Of course, the Nazarene Praise Team, St. John's Youth Choir, the Belize Choral Society, and One Praise Nation. Got it right this time. I tend to get their names mixed up. We thank you all for your contribution to the concert, and it all brought the music alive. Thank you so much. And now our vocalists. Shania, thank you. Kimberly Welch and Kimberly Blees, coming up soon with the Nazarene Praise theme. Asako, thank you, ladies, for those heartfelt renditions and our duo, which is new here. We didn't have a male duo before at the cathedral and that deep bass, you know. We enjoyed your performance, Ronnie and Jared. Thank you. And to all the instrumentalists, you each brought something new to the pieces you played. Mike, I enjoyed that rendition. And Mark and the other musicians who are the wind beneath the wings of other musicians. You hear them in the background, but they make other musicians shine. Our accompanists, uh, Yumi, where is Yumi? They're accompanists for Belize Choral Society. And Ross. And then we have Ida Ann Collins, still to come. We will hear her on the organ shortly. And then there is, let's not leave any names out. There's Silburn Authors, who always plays for the Nazarene Praise team. Where are you, Silburn? There is Silburn behind there. <laughs> and of course, we had Lawrence Craig accompanying Mike on piano. Lawrence, let's see you. Thank you, Lawrence, with the Mike Trio. And on flute tonight, we had Christelle and Naomi Ortiz. Where is Christelle? Naomi, you left. And, and on bass guitar, Wayne Godoy, Kadim Bond. On percussion, we heard him in the, mic, uh, the steel band mic trio. 
and Malachi on drums. And then we would like to thank our dancers. Thank you for that energetic energetic dance, Chrisel and company. And of course, our most esteemed accompanist, Sir Colville. Thank you once again. <laughs> of course, no one can put this show together by themselves. So I would like to thank the steering committee for being by my side and coming through every time I called. And we just wanted to point them out. Father Lloyd Taylor, Mrs. Glenda Fuller, Sandra Arnold, Dorothy Garcia, Wilbert Zelaya. So thank all of you. Now for the first time, we are actually recording the concert to be upgraded live. And we have some new kids on the block this year. We have Kalos Productions and JCs. And they're our live song and recording engineer. First is Andre Bradley, Ronnie Ellison, Sam Grande, Jacob Shehardi, and the video editing is Jonathan Fierce. Thank you guys for pitching in. We do appreciate your presence here with us. And that's the lot, everyone. But finally, I would like to thank you, the audience. You've been gracious with your applause, and the concert would not have been meaningful without your presence here tonight. So give yourself a big round of applause, and thank you for coming. <laughs> and now the highlight of the concert, the lighting of the candles. The slam, will you come, please? Thank you all, and good night. Good evening once again. We have come to that special time where we light the candles. The lighting of the candles symbolizes the light of Christ. Jesus said, whosoever follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. So as the choir sing the song, light a candle, I invite you to take out your candles, leave your pews, Form a circle around the walls of the church and let the lighting of the candle begin. Those who walk in the light of Christ will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. Kindly return to your seats after the Nazarene praise team sings, O Holy Night.
sing the hymn, O Come, O Come, Emmanuel.
The Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us pray. Purify our conscience, Almighty God, by your daily visitation, that your Son, Jesus Christ, that is coming, may find us a mission prepared for himself, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And now we'll do our final blessing. Christ, by his incarnation, gather into one all things earthly and heavenly, fill you with his joy and peace, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you and remain with you now and always. Amen. Merry Christmas, everyone.